The Rising of the Shield Hero, Tata no Yushin no Nadia Gadi, is licensed and produced by Glovision, Kurakawa, Funimation and Crunchyroll. Studios, Kinema Citrus, Networks, ATX, Tokyo MX, TVA, KBS, Sun, TVQ and BS11. Based on the works by Aniko Yusagi. Please support the official release. Hello there YouTube Jack here with more Rising of the Shield Hero, Tata no Yushin no Nadia Gadi, episode 10, and last time... It's what I'm going to talk about during the opening, because this episode starts off the opening, so let's get right into the opening. And that's 3, 2, 1, go! See, I'm not wasting time anymore. Wow, this is loud. Uh, yeah, last time, we got to meet Malty, for once, not an asshole royal. Which just, you know, makes you feel good. Just a, just a little bit, anyway. All things considered. But, yeah, after an hour from me found out, uh, wait, yep, yeah, no, but, all right. Now for me found out, I kind of wasn't too happy to learn that the seemingly nice girl is, well, you know, related to those two. By the way, this isn't even in the frame, like, the hand gesture I just made, so there's that. Also, that person is probably eventually gonna show up. But yeah, I'm still anxious. So long as we have to deal with anything related to these royals, I'm not gonna feel comfortable. Just as a general rule of thumb, not gonna let my guard down. Midst of turmoil. Well, that's convenient timing. Not allowing you to, you know, further explain your case. By the way, you've got like your holy water now, so can't you use it? Well, I get the feeling you can't leave or something. Which raises all kinds of questions. She still seems to have a fair bit of influence on Malti or something, since her name carries weight or something. But apparently she's elsewhere. Aw, poor innocent Philo. Well, he said filthy royals, so... Yes? Well, what a merry band of knights, and whoever those people on the right were. Or well, major or something, I suppose. Hey, you made allies, that's nice. Well, depending if you can trust them, but still, nice. Yeah, 
That's the dude. <laughs> Which all things considered is still amazing with given that puny shield. I mean, I know it's like fancy magic and whatnot, but it's still small. I love how it's all about money. I'm pretty sure he was one wants to gouge them a little bit on whether or not they're after money or money or something. Hmm. So that's normal then? Yeah, no way he would ever get that approval. <laughs> Fair enough, honestly. Well, yeah, that's the first time we've ever mentioned that. Which, to be fair, I mean, of course you would want to go back. Left her kind of shell shock, though. Well, probably not, but... Oh, well. Well, it's that old lady again. But hey, at least this time she's right. Like, how should I say? Justified? As opposed to the Pope thing last time? I think that's the same person anyway. I still love this guy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, sh I suppose she has grown splendidly. Well, good for him, I suppose. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I get a feeling I'm not supposed to like him, but I like him. I can't help it. Nothing still here, apparently. I mean, if so, why would the 
Are they in good relationships to the other countries? I mean, I suppose the waves are kind of a problem for everyone, so the heroes might be more generally regarded, but still. They seem to be more at home in this country. Well, you do have a demi-human slave. Eh. I mean, looks fancy enough. <laughs> At least he's haggling. <laughs> I love the perpetual, like, smile he has. Also, he's an ally. We don't have too many of them anyway. <laughs> well, you accepted the job, so... Oh, well. I suppose. <laughs> well, it's kind of hard to judge properly. Nope, that's better. The kick was one thing, but that was a proper slice. <laughs> Branch and sewer, what a nice. <laughs> okay, so it isn't like instant heal. That's fair enough. Indeed. We also gotta see whether or not the little party from before gets gets together the the money. Silver coins. Yeah, probably, you know, more hung up about that. I have no idea how that would work. You totally were. <laughs> that, maybe not. Well, she just squandered your chances. <laughs> So I guess that's them stocking up for the wave to come, huh? <laughs> I don't know if you just, uh, you know, paid to get in as you would have to or if you bribed them.
the episode was at all. I suppose that means they don't get a lot of merchants. If they are not willing to pay the toll and, you know... Those don't get to buy a lot of necessities. Well, that explains that, I suppose. And that explains it even more. This is a very sor really sorry state you're in here. So I suppose that means next episode. Oh, hey. Well, I do wonder who they're going to blame for that. That wouldn't be the same town, would it? I mean, it would make sense. All things considered. <laughs> yeah, you know, in terms of responsibility. <clears throat> I mean, vigilantes don't get paid that well, I suppose. We just saw it, you don't need to flashback. I mean, okay, at least you're adding more information. Well, yeah. Especially if you're in charge, you might as well do what you want. Well, because he probably took care of it. Also, in a certain sense, he is taking the jobs. At least they get to properly reflect on this, you know? You know, with great power comes great responsibility. Look, you're making a very dramatic exit, but you're kind of just leaving behind all the food you paid for.
Well, that's neat to have. <laughs> I don't really know what the exchange curse for gold coins and silver coins is, like how many silver do make a gold coin. Well, I suppose, you know, they passed the test, so to say. <laughs> I mean, you do, so that's nice. <laughs> Why, you're making business out of it. It's not, it's not bad, is it? Well, then again, you know, you're kind of associating with the worst of the heroes. It has a very bad reputation, so it might actually be bad for you. Well, yeah, you know. As a rule, you gotta do some unpleasant stuff. I don't you know. The first one seemed pretty okay. Though, given that the fact the fact that they get to train, they might become worse. Oh, it's you finally. Some boss level opponent. That's nice. Uh. <sighs> Uh, I love the fact that he got to tell uh, tell the other heroes what's up, basically. Uh, even if Mr. Bow Hero doesn't believe him yet, uh, Sword Hero at least seems to, you know, at least reflect upon the choices he has made, so to say. And you know, as for the bow. Hero, he can just check up on what has happened over there, how it's been. I don't know if he's gonna do that, but he could. If he has even a shred of doubt in, well, his own beliefs as opposed to what he's been told by now for me. At last, though, the next wave is starting. We didn't get to do class upgrades, so that's a shame. Generally, does the king just want him to die? I'm not even saying this, like, sarcastically. I think he just literally wants him to die. Would make, well, not sense. I don't know why they're ganging up on him like that. Someone in the comments once said that this is going to be explained eventually, which... Yay, but point is, they definitely want him dead, because, I mean, you're gonna strip him of, of his reputation, of all his money. Yeah, you pretty much just leave him to die. <laughs> then again, does he have to fight in the waves? I mean, if he were a total scumbag, couldn't he just, I don't know, ditch them? Or something? I really don't know. But yeah, I legitimately, you know, had a bit of a higher opinion of the bow hero, though. Kind of, I mean, not the fact that he accidentally, you know, drove uh, an entire village, country, whatever, into poverty. But rather the fact that he is a bit in denial about it. Well, you know, then again, if you think yourself heroic and then someone who is accused of various crimes just stand up, stands up and tells you... Hey, all the good deeds you do, you know, they are actually causing more bad than good. You might be inclined not to believe them. Just because, you know, what they are saying completely clashes with your worldview. People don't like it when you do that. 
in general, pretty much worldwide. It's not it's not really a fantasy thing. But yeah. That's the thing. Just just gotta point it out there. But other than that, I don't know. Next wave is starting. Now from we got a bit of a party. I don't, I don't know how good they are. At least they're gonna get better gear or something out of it. So we'll see where that goes. In any case, though, that will have to be all for now and until next time. See you then.